What's up YouTube? It's your boy ET. And I know it's been a minute since I last posted. A lot of stuff has been going on in real life and plus I haven't really been playing the game that much outside of franchise, but I'm gonna get right back into it. Especially with Zero Chill coming out. Zero Chill is always and I mean always one of the best promos ever. Every year in Madden. It's lit, the presence, everything. And as you can see my opponent throws a pick to start the game. He came out in strong close. I've seen a lot of people in strong close recently. I think uh, the YouTuber Throne dropped a free ebook, or he either dropped a free ebook or like his ebook got around or something. I'm not sure, but he runs strong close and apparently is really high powered. But uh, he throws a pick. It was my first time seeing seeing somebody actually run strong close in a minute, like as a full scheme. Now look at that pocket, Tyreek weave, Tyreek the free. If you don't have a Tyreek on your team, you're doing it all wrong. But as you guys can also see, me and my opponent are both running 3-3-5 odd. It's just, it's just the best blitz in the game right now. Because you got that 90 overall, I mean not 90 overall, 88 overall, 90 speed Montez Sweat. Coming around the edge, going right around the tackle for instant sacks. If you're not running 3-3-5 odd, I don't, I don't know what you're running. <laughs> like, I really don't know. But right here, I give up a touchdown. Just bad adjustments on my part. I should have known... If I I ran the same defense the last time, and he got a good 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 yardage on this last play, and then I ran it again, and I didn't I didn't switch up nothing, and and seen it again. If you're playing somebody with a brain, if you run the same coverage back to back, and you just keep running the same coverage, they're gonna figure out a way to hit you over over your head over the top, which he did. But as you can see, he sacked me. He's in three three five odd two, and you know I'm taking the steps to block it. I got my tight end right wide open, Jeremy Shockey. I like this Jeremy Shockey a lot. I used to have Jermichael Finley, but this Jeremy Shockey's been getting the job done. Right here, we hit another dot corner route to Ayuk, taking it to the crib. Brendan Ayuk is another budget beast. He gets Slotomatic for 2 AP. He's 95 speed. And Slotomatic, as you guys know, is the best route running ability in the game. And not only do you get good route running, you get good catching with it as long as they're in the slot. Right there, he hits me with a nice little dot uh, out the backfield with the running back. And as you can see, I left 3-3-5 odd versus strong close. I did not like it versus his offense. Um, I didn't feel comfortable in it, especially after he hit me over the head with that uh, with that corner route. And then strong close, you know, you could run the ball and 3-3-5 odd, even with inside stuff. It's not good versus a formation like that. They could just run the ball all over you. Right, so I went to 55 wide, and I'm just user blitzing them. That's the pro downside with running under center. It's a lot easier to get user blitz and insta sack. So like he comes out in this, and my mindset is, I'm just gonna user blitz the hell out of him uh, as much as I can. Right there, I didn't user blitz, but I did hold him. He only got a short gain right here. So now it's fourth and long. He no huddle. He's going for it, and. You know, I'm thinking I'm gonna just use a blitz him right here. I'm gonna just use a blitz him, be done with it, get the ball back. But uh, it didn't work. I got picked up and I gave up 13 yards <laughs> to a seam, and that's just bad. Right there, he throws right at my flats. It should have been picked. But yeah, I played bad defense. Uh, I should have just played regular defense. I would have got a stop. And right here, I ran basic cover two, and I left my responsibility, which is the deep middle. And he hits me over the middle for a touchdown. Right here, I got Jeremy Shockey. He breaks a tackle. I actually went for a possession catch. And him getting hit by the safety kept him on his feet somehow. I don't know. The game is weird. And right here, we hit Tyreek over the top. Like I said, if you don't have Tyreek, who do you have? <laughs> if you don't have Tyreek, like, I, I don't know what to say. Because y'all seen what he did to the Bucks in real life. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Y'all seen what he did to the Bucks in real life. What he doing to players in the video game? I mean, it's just it's, it's hard. You can't just man him up. You can't, and I don't even have Tyreek max speed. Like he could hit 98 speed. I don't have a Chiefs team team, so he's 97 speed on my team, and that's still enough. Right here, I got no clue what dude was doing. He should have been just threw the ball away. Instead, he runs 200 miles backwards. I didn't understand that. And with that, I set my zone drops, and the uh, Montez comes screaming. Best player in the game. It's, it's no doubt about it. If you don't have that Montez Sweat card, look, it's two cards you gotta have. You gotta have Montez Sweat and you gotta have Tyreek. 
You could you could figure out everything else. You know what I'm saying? Like you could use a Dante Culpepper over Josh Allen. You could use an Escape Artist QB over Josh Allen. You could use a whole assortment of tight ends, wide receivers, uh, running backs. But then again, if you're not using Reggie Bush, I don't know who you're using either. Right here, I shanked the field goal right before half. I mean, like I'm I'm just a terrible field goal kicker. I'm not gonna lie to you. Like that meter be fucking my life up. <laughs> I be having the crabs with that meter. I swear the meter has a mind of its own on the kick. And, like, it be, it be messing me up. And right here, he comes in screaming. So, like, he's got this Montez popping. Like, sometimes I'm able to block it. Sometimes I'm just lazy. I don't put the, and I don't do every step to block it. And I wind up getting set. But, this is basically the end of the video. I'm about to score again soon. And he, he's gonna quit. And, uh,. Yeah, that's basically it. I caught him. He put his safety in a flat because he was trying to combat on that drag corner combo, and I caught him lacking. But, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed the video.